Hey guys, it's TX Raw, and we're back with another video. I hope you enjoyed the last one. Today, I hit 2 million views on my video, and I'm very proud, so I'll be going to two different places today. So, I'll talk about that in the next clip. So, before I start this, the first place I'm going to is Fresh Kitchen. So, I'm going to start myself off with a healthy snack, and then later on, I'm going to eat dessert for 2 million. I'm going to be eating ice cream. Right. So first off, if you can hear me, I'm going to grab a drink. I'm not sure which drink I want to grab. Uh, it's lemon lime, watermelon cherry. I guess we'll probably go with black cherry. I never tried this before, but no, let's try it. Back, and I got the food. I see it's right here. It looks so delicious, and I will tell you what's in the ingredients. So I got brown rice, cauliflower, avocado rice, and they told me it was kind of like uh, the avocado rice was kind of spicy, so that should be interesting as well. Um, I also got the sesame green beans as a veggie. And for the protein, I got roasted herb salmon. So, and as the sauce, I got some type of, what was it again? It was holy kale, so it's like a greenish kale dressing. But, um, can't wait to try it, and yeah, I'm gonna get with this video. Okay, so now I'm going to try the avocado rice. They said it was going to be like spicy, but we'll see. I really like it. It's a 9 out of 10. It's not spicy at all. Kind of had a kick, but it's not really that spicy. And it tasted like really good. And I can taste the avocado. So, yeah. We're going to try the green beans with the holy kale sauce. It's not sitting right. I don't like the taste of it. The taste of the holy kale, it does not. Let me give it a second try. Maybe I'm missing something. Mm -mm. No, I don't like it. It kind of tastes like ranch. But it kind of doesn't because I can taste the, the kale in it. I don't know what else is in it, but it does not taste as good. You probably mix avocado with it, but I rate that a 3 out of 10. I don't like the dressing, so I'm not going to continue eating it. But we're going to get with the salmon. Salmon, salmon. I don't know how people say it. It looks interesting because it has the lemon on it. Wait, do I have to squeeze the lemon? Okay, so it was already melting on it. It's just got padded. Like fresh professional chefs. So you pad it. See me pad it. Pad it like a baby. Okay. Bring that up. And we'll try it. It looks like it's well done. Yes, yeah, well done cooked. So I don't have to worry about getting sick. Sorry for the noise in the background. Yes. Yes. They cooked it right. So not a lot of people can cook salmon. So. But this. I like the texture. It's cooked with perfection. I don't know what seasonings they probably put on it. But it tastes good. And 11... I said lemon. The lemon makes it ten, taste ten times better. But overall, the salmon is a million out of ten. I love it. I really like salmon, fish, seafood, any type of seafood, honestly. 
and it's like I forgot what that either it's Italian or French word so I kind of forgot what it was but bueno I'll say Spanish bueno. but you know this not that bad so I'll keep drinking I gotta take it back And it's not as good, but it's all right. But overall, the whole thing is a 10 out of 10. I just don't like the sauce, so meh, get rid of the sauce. But I really like it. I recommend trying Fresh Kitchen. Uh, it's in multiple parts, I believe. Multiple parts of the country, should be. But it was really good. But now we're gonna switch over to desserts for hitting two million. So, you know, I'll see you there. Okay, editor, switch. Oh, hi, you're back. Okay, so we're at the ice cream place, Jenny's Splendid Ice Cream. Ice cream. And here it is. It looks really good. I got the trio. So there's three different ice creams. And the three different ice creams that I got was bland berry crisp, brown butter almond brittle, and salted peanut butter with chocolate flakes. The almond is right here. That's good for flowers. It's magnificent. I really love flowers, but they're fake. Like, those are real. Pretty. But we're going to try. We're gonna try the brown butter on the mm. Let's try that again because it's a lot. It tastes good. It kind of tastes like I'm eating a stick of butter, but I can also taste the milk. It's really cold. And it's like it's soothing to eat on. So if you're ever crying, you're sad, you need some ice cream, just order some jellies. Not that I'm getting sponsored by this, but yeah, go ahead and eat, eat some jellies. We're going to try this one, which is the Bramble Berry Crisp. It's a weird name, but yeah, we're, we're gonna try it. Okay. It tastes weird, but as I was reading, it's in it. It's bramble berry jam, so it's jam with ice cream. Never really had this before, so it tastes weird. Kind of tastes like grape jam, but peanut butter sandwich. Yeah. So, so it's okay. It's not bad. So I rated it. A good four and a half out of ten. And their first one, I rated a eight out of ten. Now, the last, the last ice cream, I asked the lady what her favorite ice cream was, and she said it was the 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 salted peanut butter with chocolate flex. So we're gonna try to reach to it because it's at the bottom of the ice cream. It's the first one she scooped in, so. Okay, I got it.
kind of melting right now, but it's okay. Celebrating two million views. Two million views. Oh, it's melting. Try to fix that. Okay, so I'll go live later. I gotta go. Um, yeah. Everybody have a good day. Uh, and yeah. Peace out.